Don Williams again for the Institute of Sports and Spines. Today, we're showing you a demonstration of a full max capacity blood lactate test. At Institute of Sports and Spines, we have a Monarch LC7 test bike, one of the top test bikes in the world at the moment, and it allows us to run a step test at 25 watt intervals at two minute sessions, which will go for the duration of the athlete's capacity. We also use a Lactate Scout Plus blood lactate composition computer which gives us an accurate representation of what their blood lactate does at each corresponding heart rate level and power output level. The start of the test is fairly simple. We always start with a 50 watt output. This allows us a slow gradient curve with the athlete not under too much load initially. This allows the blood lactate level to stabilise, the heart rate to be nice and comfortable at the early wattage levels. As the heart rate increases in response to increased load, blood lactate level shows an increase until it spikes at the level where the body can no longer process it at a rate at which it's being created. This shows us the blood lactate threshold. With the combination of data from the lactate scout and the LC7, we can show an athlete at what heart rate and power output their lactate threshold is used. They can use this data then to formulate their training zones and they can use the data depending on what test capacity they have on their bike, whether that be heart rate or wattage.